Hi, how are you? So let's deal with this question. This would come in useful if the only way to get a BIOS file is from ASUS support. Are there any guides on how to resize and add missing board info? Okay, here's a quick guide. So your model, your laptop model is ASUS X441B. Let's copy it. Okay, yes. we paste it here and we search for BIOS. So let's see if we got on this support results. Here is one. Let's see what it does. Yeah. Okay, let's deal with this uh, as an example. So we have here the BIOS. We are going to download it. I am going to use the folder I uh, created in a while when I'm dealing with your BIOS. Okay, let's open the folder. Yes, let's extract. So here we have it, this one. As you can see here, we have uh, it's a bin file, but with the uh, for bigger size uh, as the standard sizes of uh, eight megabyte file. Uh, let's check, for example, let's download, let's download this one, your original one, to uh, compare the sizes. So let's compare. Let's open. So we have the one from the net is here, uh, your original is this one, let's move it to the same folder where the one we have just downloaded is, let's open, so we have our boot files, uh, the original one, this one, sorry, this one, as you said it's the original. So, and the other one is from uh, the site. This one. As you can see here, we have here 8192 and here we have 8194. It's, it's not a big difference, in fact, uh, in terms of size, but the problem is that this won't work with the, any programmer. You will get an error during uh, programming and uh, it won't work, even if uh, you manage to program it in your uh, ship so to resize it it's it's really easy we are going to open both files with our IHXD editor so so here we have the one from this so as this uh, site and uh, the original dump let's do ctrl a here to select all so pay attention to this length eight zero 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 five zeros and here if we do the same thing ctrl a we have uh, eight zero zero eight zero zero so uh, it's simple uh, as you can see here the the footer uh, the header of the files are different the beginning we call it the header so here the header is different from this one so this is this one is the original the header should look like this and this one is from the site and the header uh, uh, don't look don't look like uh, a standard BIOS file as this BIOS file so which means that the difference between the two files uh, is uh, in the beginning so this one from the site we have to remove what is uh, in the beginning so the simplest way to do that is simply let's copy two lines here on the original or three lines copy and search for the same 
hex values in uh, the one we have downloaded from uh, the sites uh, as you can see here begins the header of the BIOS file so we came here here just before the start of our BIOS file came here you click and you go till the beginning and before clicking here you press uh, you press the tab key and hold pressing and click here so that you got this selected you press the uh, delete key in your keyboard and you save the file save it as uh, let's call it let's call it row size row sized bin dot bin so if we go back to our folder here where where are we this is this is uh, let's move it to the folder where the original and the one from uh, this site is and let's see the bin 8192 and the original is 192 so we have the right size so let's Uh, this is uh, one way. Another way is that uh, to do simple calculate. Let's open another time this one. As you have here, as you can see here, the difference between this one and this one in terms of size is we have 800800 and we have here 8 with 5 zeros why simply so the difference is 800 in terms of hex, uh, hex length so we we came here sorry we came to the beginning here uh, we click with the right click we select our block which should be the length of should be the difference between the two files which means 800 so as you can see well, we have selected what is additional in this file we delete we save our file so let's save it directly here we have received bin let's call it received bin uh, copy which means the now let's compare them let's close this and open this one and this one so let's open them both also we have the first one and the second one they, they should be the same thing and that's it the chosen files are identical i hope it's clear so uh, here's the answer to your question it's easy to answer like this uh, so bye bye